Hey internet, today I am in Patapsco Valley State Park and I've decided to go on a hike. I haven't been on a hike in a while. I guess since we went on that 23 mile hike on the Appalachian Trail. And I've kind of been really missing like getting outside and doing things and so I decided today I was gonna go on a hike. It's a Friday so a lot of the people that I would normally go on a hike with aren't available and so I just kind of had to do it by myself. So I thought this would be an interesting opportunity to talk about why <laughs> this is weird for me. I don't do a lot of things by myself, and by a lot of things, I mean a lot of things. My freshman year in college, there were all of the food places that they have on campus, and I didn't go to a single one of them until I had a friend go with me first to kind of <laughs> give me an example of what to do. It's just one of those weird things that I have. Like, I didn't like to call the pizza guy for the longest time. I think it was like junior year in college before I did that. Never gone to a movie alone. I've never gone to anything but a fast food place alone. Um, it's just, it's not something that appeals to me. It's scary. Uh, I don't know. It's weird, one of my weird quirks. So this is a strange thing that I'm doing. I mean, I guess the reason that going on a hike makes more sense than going out to a movie or a restaurant or whatever is that I don't really have to see anybody, like I don't have to interact with another human being. So I guess that works. I mean, safety-wise, maybe going in the middle of Podasco Valley State Park on my own for four miles isn't the best idea, but if you're seeing this, I survived, so we're good. I'm not really that worried about it. Yeah, I think that's the major issue. I guess I'm just so self-conscious. I'm afraid that if I do something on my own for the first time, I'll do it wrong. And the person that I'm interacting with will think something weird of me. Um, and it's so silly because a lot of times if I go to a place like that and I interact with someone, that's the only time I'm ever going to interact with them. And what does it matter? And honestly, to me, it might seem like the end of the world if I do the wrong thing or do things in the wrong order, but to them it's just like one little part of their day. So it, yeah, I mean like I'm fully aware that it's weird. But that being said, this move in particular, I'm sorry if the road is loud. That being said, this move in particular has helped me a lot with doing things alone. I've done a lot more things alone in the past, what is it? Eight months? Nine months? Ten months? Ten months? Holy crap. Uh, I've done a lot of things in the past ten months that I probably would not have done previously out of necessity because I've been basically alone up here. So anyway, maybe for that reason this move was good. Uh, even though it's lonely at times. But yeah. Are you ever afraid of doing things alone? Uh, it, is anyone else out there as weird as I am? Let me know down in the comments. I'm sure that everyone was quite concerned, but I did in fact make it back out of the car. So I successfully survived my first ever solo hike. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you all later.